Well, the first cold front of the season putting some pressure on local citrus growers. Channel 5's Cecilia Gutierrez explains the wind and rain associated with this front isn't always a good thing. The recent relief from the heat isn't always a welcome experience to growers. They say it's a warning sign. It's called citrus canker. It's a disease on citrus trees and is often spread through weather like a cold front brings. Hector Betters says harvest started last week, but the weather today kept them out of the fields. We try to pick as much as we could on Saturday and Sunday and, and Friday. So cause I knew they predicted rains and here it is. The roller coaster of weather phenomena this year has not been easy for citrus growers like Betters. If it's not one thing, it's another thing. It's greeny, canker. You know, drought, uh, hurricanes, when there's a hurricane. So it's always something going on. With the wind driven rain, Pettis is now looking out for citrus canker. President of Texas Citrus Mutual Dale Merton says growers usually look to hurricanes to spread bacteria from tree to tree, but cold fronts like today's can do the same thing. When these fronts start blowing in, we start to really look and prepare and, and try to educate the public as much as we can. The wind and rain associated from a front can cause big problems for growers. Wind-driven rain will spread this bacteria, could potentially spread it. I mean, the, the quarantine that we most keep our eye on is the one in Houston. With this winter forecasted to be on the wetter side of things, Merton says other issues can hurt the industry as well. For us, wet weather is a problem because we can't get back into the groves to treat if we needed to. For now, Merton says all they can do is wait for the ground to dry out to continue harvest. Merton says the best way to stop the spread of canker is through education and communication. He says if you have a citrus tree and think the disease is on that tree, to contact the AgriLife Extension Office in Westlaco at 968-5581. In Edinburgh, Cecilia Gutierrez, Channel 5 News at 6.